worked at a startup and now at one of the world's biggest brands. How do you bring that culture of a startup into such an established brand? Well, bringing the culture of a startup to a big brand is actually not as hard as people think. Um, predominantly just because actually big brands need the sense of urgency that there is in a startup. Um, the energy, the dynamism, the ability to think round corners when there are limitations um, and to really try and get stuff done. And, and actually, if the chief exec is really inspired uh, to do things differently, then he needs people who are going to behave as if it's a startup. Obviously, there's been a huge amount written about the lack of women in technology, the lack of women in digital marketing and the role of women in our industry. Um, what more do you think the industry can do to address these issues? I think that the first thing that has to be done to address the lack of women in tech roles and also in senior marketing roles is help women with mentoring and also just providing decent role models. I see myself as somebody who can really provide a good role model for women um, and not just because I'm a woman and I think this is really really important. I think that women really look to people who have a sense of compassion, who are authentic leaders, who treat people really well and when I came back from maternity leave I remember looking around and thinking I don't want to be like any of these leaders, they happen to all be men just because of their leadership styles and I didn't find that there was a role model I could really aspire to be. When I look at BBC Worldwide however, one of the reasons I was so keen to come back to the BBC, there are both men and women who are in senior leadership positions who uh, treat people with fairness and respect um, and treat people really well. How important is culture and having the right culture when it comes to sort of driving innovation but also driving success on a personal level? I think culture is absolutely critical and it begins with a sense of purpose uh, within the organisation that permeates through everybody. So here at the BBC we all have a really strong sense of purpose and we understand what we're here to do. And if you haven't got a sense of purpose and you're just there to make a lot of money, it becomes really hard for people to give up and do a lot and go that extra mile.